everybody, how are you doing today? Ready to learn more? I'm exchanging information, I'm in tune with the world In the air there is the message For me to learn and grow So, use the web, read the news, watch TV, use the phone These are my tools Use the web, read the news, watch TV, use the phone To connect to you Lesson 29 Movie session at home O que aprendemos na nossa última aula? What did we learn in our last class? A lot of verbs in the simple past. Remember. Made. Prepared. Brought. Read. Wrote. Ate. Drank. New. Moving forward then. Hello. Hello, Lucas. I rented five Brazilian movies. Can we start a movie session earlier than 7 o'clock? We have a lot of movies to watch. Okay, how about 5 o'clock? Five movies to watch? What a big movie session! Sabem como se diz cedo em inglês? É assim. Early. E sabem como se diz mais cedo? É assim, ó. Earlier. The movie session starts earlier than 7 o'clock. A sessão começa mais cedo que 7 horas. Earlier than, mais cedo que. Hi. Hello. <laughs> Let me help you with those bags, Mariana. Oh, take this one with a soft drink. This is heavier than that. <laughs> Where did you rent those movies? I rented them on a video store on the north side of the town. It was cheaper than that one on our neighborhood. Oh yes, I think it's the cheapest video store in town. Perceberam que estamos comparando uma coisa com outra? Right? Por exemplo, Mariana tem duas sacolas. Mariana has two bags. Uma é mais pesada do que a outra. E esta ela dá para o Pedro. Take this one with a soft drink. This is heavier than that. <laughs> heavier than quer dizer mais pesado que. Heavier than. Essa coisa de colocar o ER depois do adjetivo é para compararmos. Por exemplo, I am heavier than this kid. But I am lighter than this man. Understood? Where did you rent those movies? I rented them on a video store on the north side of the town. It was cheaper than that one on our neighborhood. Oh yes, I think it's the cheapest video store in town. One store is always cheaper than another. Temos que procurar a mais barata. We have to look for the cheapest. Estamos comparando mais de duas lojas, portanto utilizamos o superlativo e não o comparativo. Oh, I can't believe it. Mariana, what are you doing here? It's so nice to see you. I didn't know you moved from Sao Paulo. I live here now. No way. Yes. Me too. Oh. We have to go out together. What's your phone number? I'm going to call you every day. <laughs> I'm near in town and I need somebody to show me around, okay? Okay. It's good. No way é uma expressão bem casual que significa algo tipo I can't believe it. Eu não acredito. Será possível? This is Julia and this is Pedro. They are my friends. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I have to go. Oh. I got your number. I'm going to call you, okay? Okay. Bye. Bye. So who was that man? Just a friend from Sao Paulo. He's very good looking. 
I think he's the ugliest man in the whole world. It looks like somebody's jealous. Don't worry, Pedro. I think you are more good looking than him. Good looking é o contrário de ugly. Aos olhos do Pedro, aquele homem era o mais feio de todos. Tadinho. E a Mariana? O que disse? I think you are more good looking than him. Good looking é uma palavra muito grande. E para palavras como estas, nós utilizamos more antes delas, ao invés do er ao final das mesmas. Pedro is more good looking than Carlos. That store is more expensive than the other one. Let's start. The first film we can watch is the oldest one. It was made in 1964. Then we can watch this film, made in 2002. After that, we can discuss to see which one we think is better or worse. What did you think? I thought the first one was better than the second one. Uh-uh, the second movie was the best. <laughs> Old é o contrário de new. The first movie was older than the second one. Quando queremos dizer que uma coisa é melhor ou pior do que outra, aí a coisa fica diferente. Dizemos better than, melhor que, ou worse than, pior que. Pelé was better than Maradona, right? So, Maradona was worse than Pelé. Vamos falar a verdade, né? Pelé was the best soccer player ever, wasn't he? I have to admit those things that he used to do with the other players, you know, where she would like pretend to go one way and then go the other way and the players would be so confused and then he'd... Ah, he... This movie was the longest of all. I thought it would never be over. We can't watch another movie, Mariana. I'm too tired. Yes, and it's getting late. If we watch another movie, it's going to get more dangerous for us to go back to our house. You're right. Let's go. We can watch the last one tomorrow morning. Hurry up. We have to go back faster than when we came here. It's safer. Dangerous é o oposto de safe. E fast, vocês já sabem o que significa? A Ferrari is faster than a Fusca. A lot faster, I have to say. So, a Fusca is slower than a Ferrari. Time for our review. O que aprendemos hoje chamamos de comparativos e superlativos. Para compararmos alguma coisa, acrescentamos um ER no final do adjetivo e usamos a palavra THAN. Lucas is taller than Mariana. Or, Mariana is shorter than Lucas. Mas, quando quisermos dizer que alguma coisa é a melhor, a pior, a maior de todas, aí utilizamos o artigo the antes do adjetivo e o est no final do adjetivo, ok? Amazonas is the biggest state in Brazil. And Sergipe is the smallest state in Brazil. Mas, but, toda regra tem a sua exceção. Os adjetivos good e bad tem comparativos e superlativos especiais. Better than e the best. Worse than e the worst. Comparem pessoas ou coisas para vocês praticarem esses adjetivos que vocês aprenderam. So you can practice these adjectives that you learned, ok? E atenção! Procurem rever toda a matéria das lições 21 a 29 
21 to 29, porque o nosso próximo encontro será uma revisão. Ok, teacher, good luck to you. They're all yours. I'm exchanging information. I'm in tune with the world. On the air there is the message for me to learn and grow. I can use the web to update myself. I must read the news. We can hear the message as I sing.